we are happy to say that the cartoon introduction to climate change is now done. It's here. Here it is. And the book has great stuff for you know high school and in introductory college classes, and I guess I was really thinking about it um, as a book that folks who care about climate change could give to their family and friends and neighbors who might not care all that much about climate change as a way to sort of uh, introduce them to the subject, to something that they care about, but it's not going to be sort of a gloom and doom, 300 page daunting kind of book. Something that our books do ex extremely well mm -hmm. is putting these uh, issues in the context of the reader. You are there with the material because of the way the characters are designed. And, you know, instead of the earth tilted over, freezing on one side and burning on the other, it's, you know, a, a person in tidy whities um, um, The tidy whities allows us to have a little bit of quasi-bathroom humor, and that, that never hurts. Can only be a good thing. I think that all of our books, we try to engage audiences at different levels, and so you could look through the book and overlook that, skip that part, not notice that because you're going through and you're getting the jokes and learning a bit of the material, or you could really go back and do a second reading yeah. uh, and get a lot more details that we put into the, uh, that we put into the book. We don't have that many graphs in the book. We do have, of course, the Keeling curve of carbon dioxide concentrations, and you found a terrific way to present that, which was to uh, pair it next to the Mona Lisa and then there's the Keeling curve right the next to it. The most famous image in the world. Yeah. And uh, it's a hopeful book as well as a descriptive book. And each page needs to be great. And I think we did it. And that's impressive because the subject matter, you know, potentially very dire. Now it does so happen that what started out as sort of this scientific curiosity now turns out to be, uh, you know, one of the more important issues of this century. and. Uh, we hope that the cartoon book is going to be a, a small contribution to the discussion about that. And as we say at the end of the book, you know, sort of good luck to us all.